Question number 10. The equation of a trigonometric wave is given by y is equals to 4 sine ax minus 70 degrees. The wave has a period of 180 degrees. A. Determine the value of A. B. Deduce the face angle of the wave. Now to solve this question, uh, there is an equation that you are going to use. If you are given an equation that is of the form y is equals to k sine of uh, bx plus or minus angle theta or the equation can also be in this form k cosine of bx plus or minus angle theta then uh, you're supposed to know that k is the amplitude of that wave this is the, the equation of the wave so if it is in that format those two formats then no k is the amplitude then um, the period the period is given by 360 divided by b and then uh, finally the face angle is equals to angle theta th these two equations of this format will help you to determine uh, the period the amplitude and also the face angle so let's go to the question having known that um, look at the equation here and try to compare the equation that we have here y is equals to 4 sine ax minus 70 degrees so what is the value of a so when you look at the value of a where the value of a is it is equivalent to b so the value of a is equivalent to b that we have here in the other equation so how do we get this given that the period of this wave is 180 how do we get the period i've just indicated mm. here the period is given by 360 divided by b and you're given that angle is 180 so when we solve this uh, equation we'll be able to get the value of b and in this case in this equation that you have your y is equals to 4 sine ax minus 70 uh, a in this equation is equivalent to b so we shall not use b in this equation uh, but we'll use um, a since in this equation it is indicated by letter a a is equivalent to b in that equation so to get um, a we get 360 divided by a is equals to 180 and when you work out this you get 180 is equals to 360 and a will be 2 so that is how we get the value of a. Now, did use the face angle, the wave. So look at the two equations that I indicated here. So looking at that, those two equations and comparing what we have here, uh, the face angle is very easy to identify. So the face angle is what we have here, where we have 70. We don't take the negative uh, angle. So we not take that one as um, negative 70. The face angle will be simply positive 70 that is very important to note that you don't consider the negative angle but you take the face angle to be positive so that is how we're supposed to solve that question